everybody, it's Nadia Rowe here again and I'm bringing to you a Poundland haul. So, I've been on a rummage. So, I thought, yes, I'll bring this to you. So, I'm going to just semi-sort them out because, oh, I'm not. <laughs> I'm just going to dive right in. But before I do... If you want to see more unboxing hauls, anything, trying these on, how I feel about them, then please let me know in the comments below or even a tutorial because apart from a foundation there probably is enough to do a tutorial. Um, so yeah, um, and if you enjoy watching and you're new to my channel, please hit the subscribe button and tap that little bell and it will tell you when I bring out my videos. So let's get on to it. I'm in a hyper mood. Right, so we're going to start off with these got two eyeshadows. These were all a pound guys. So I've just got a bin at the side of me so that I can open them. Show you and test them. So although I don't really need blue eyeshadow Oh, and they've all got, and they've all got a sticky on it as well. So, right. This is the NYC. You always get the little stupid sponges. <laughs> I don't know why. Um, not nowadays. Um, so yeah, that's that, and that's really pretty. And no fallout, guys. Oh. Now that's a pretty pink, that's really nice, so yes, we'll definitely have to bring some sort of tutorial or something, I don't know, I can't get this back in its packaging, I don't know. So that was the pink one, the next one is just the blue one obviously. We gotta go get together, na 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 na. So this is the blue, it looks quite dark, comes off really well, oh that'll be a nice blue, although it comes off it, that looks beautiful and a lot of people are like you can't wear blue, why can't you, I like blue eyeshadow, you know, I really do like blue eyeshadow, so so then the next ones are these two, these are more eyeshadows, I'm just cutting the top off, these are the green and purple and the weather's gone really dreary and dull and not very nice. So this is the green one, that's a nice olive green, that really is, that was once what I went like that, I'll show you next time. On the next one that's really pretty i do like that so sounds really sad but i'm putting the inserts back in so this is a gorgeous purple so i don't know if it's gorgeous it's just know it's purple <laughs> why do people say silly things like that well this is really gorgeous well how do you know you've never actually put it on your eyes yet so so this is the purple one and I'm going to show you this time. That was one swipe. Oh look at it. I only did the extra bit at the end. That That's wonderful whether or not it will come across when I come to use it. I don't know. But 50p and eyeshadow. More to add to my collection. So the next one is this, it just says branded cosmetic on it, so and this has got three pieces in it and one is a Max Factor eyeshadow, Vibrant Move, I like Move, I really do like Move, so that's what it looks like, nice purple. Oh, I do like that. Just there. That looks beautiful. 
really does. Let's take them off so that I can. That's really nice. I would definitely. I'll probably depop these and use them. Again, another Max Factor. Wild. But these will probably be last season's. Because obviously it's palm wood and there's no way they. This is very gritty. But I think it's because it's got a bit of a spark. Yeah, it's definitely got a bit of sparkle in it. That's gorgeous. That's really pretty. Um, and then we've got a Manhattan High Shan lip gloss. I don't like lip gloss, but it is just just a little pink lip gloss. So, and that will just go away for somebody. So, then I got these three. So, Miss, Miss Sporty. So, let's see what the white one is. The white one's got no name on it. Oh, it's an orange one. So, it's a balm. It's just a balm. There's nothing coming off. So, yes, we'll use that. And then we've got Miss Sporty in... Who got my flowers and push it up so that it's like a really pale pink I, I like wearing these sort of things it sounds really silly but you know because they're so gloopy if you put it on in bed my lips are absolutely stunning the only problem is if you get a too dark a color and you're trying to do that and that's like the marvia one just there so then we've got eye pencil trio star by nyc again so we've got a black a blue and a oh that's nice and it wasn't as hard as what i was expecting it to be but it's it's more of a blacky color but it is actually a navy so loving that black actually it's not see this is where you could get really confused this is more of a burgundy that one was quite hard so when I rubbed it on it was quite hard so it might have to be ooh, warmed up so I'm not even saying what colour this is because Oh, that's that's really clever. This has got that glitter in it, blue glitter. I don't know if it's coming off on camera. Oh, I really hope it does. So yeah, for a pound. Do not judge. Do not judge. I have actually got a foundation here, and it is darker than my skin colour because I think this was. L'Oreal Paris Ma Ma Magic. So, but for me, for a pound, I was like, well, what I'll just do, oh, it's a mousse. It's a mousse. Mousse, mousse. So, extremely too dark for me. I could actually use that as a bronzer. That's really weird. And I could, that would actually go to go into a really nice bronzer. I do like that. So, I thought it would be liquidy. So I could add the droppers to it. Because I've got the lightning drops. And it's so, so strange. That's really good, that is. So, yeah. Pad. You know. Um, just trying to make room right oh I'll open this one being as it's already opened so we've got a nail varnish which this was originally priced £2.48 because it's got the price on it the colour is Starry Night so 
it looks greeny oh i do like that really do it might be coming off blue it has got a blue undertone but it's a greeny blue that is beautiful and then we've got a lipstick and this is priced at £8.29 they've obviously not taken the prices off so this is number 315 precious precious oh yes it's so precious in French as well so but I really like that colour it's I don't know what it's coming like off that is really pretty it is it has got a purple slight purple undertone but it's more in the mauve colour on camera it's looking like pink but it's not I do like that that's going straight into my lipstick holder we've got another this would need a good shape but this is a beautiful summer colour really is so as we know these were 249 and look at the opaqueness on that i'll be glad to be wearing that in the summer that'd be nice colour to wear so and again we've got another lipstick and again with the price on so and this is number 415 in seven 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 I don't know. S siren siren. S I R E N. You decide. Cause I can't. This is very pink. And it's pink, but it'd be nice for the summer. Really will be nice. So I like that. You know, so I've got a special place for everything that I put things when I put things down. Looper. So this time we get a Rimmel soft eyeliner in this colour. And the number, it's not got a number, has it got a name? Needs a bit of warming up. But it's gorgeous blue. Can't afford a good blue. I like blue. So and then we've got this glossy pink oh we're more lasting finish pro uh top coat looks yellow in the bottle and it really does but it's definitely varnish let's smell it i'll tell you oh yeah that's varnish <coughs> Yeah, that was varnish. Next ones are these Rimmel Scandalous Sticks, the green one. I've had these before. In fact, I've probably got one in my collection. And it's that gorgeous green at the side. These will be passed on because no, I've already got them. But it was this, this glitter bomb that I really liked. I just thought, you know, for Christmas, and I know it's not Christmas, but it's Christmas every, every year, so, you know, and it's a glitter bomb. So, I was like, yes, I'm taking it. Another one, so I agree, it's the green one again, so I don't really need to show you that one. And I think I've already got this colour. And it's called the glitter bomb, but it's in gold. So I'm not too sure, I will have to check them ones back there. <laughs> so, a double baggie as well. I like the baggies. And this is the lip lacquer from Collections. And it does come out of that colour. I'm not going to, oh well I might as well. But I won't be keeping it because it is so stringy. I wouldn't give this to anybody it's it's horrible it really is I don't like it at all so no and then I got this gorgeous blue Galactica nail polish and from collections that is beautiful that is so nice so so nice such a nice blue 
Right, so we've got nail varnish now. And these are literally, I love these. Um, this is the gold one, Hot Shots, these are called. And they are so freaking good. It's unbelievable. I love them. Um, they stay on your nails. They last. So I've already got the gold one. Not going to open it. It will go away. Um, I have got a daughter that's not at home. So I put things that I've got double of away. And these are collections. But they are really, really pretty. Especially this one for the summer. So I'll just put them there for now. Then we've got some more of the hot shots. And that's a gorgeous, it's like orangey, red, with gold. It's really pretty. Really is. So, and then this is more of a grey, oh, I don't even know what you'd call it. It's just, it's like got a purplish undertone to it it's really really pretty unbelievably pretty so so that's that one we're getting to the final guys and girls so again two more nail varnishes these are from oh god why do they don't they just put oh Courtney Kim and Chloe, I didn't even know they brought nail varnishes out. So that'll be gorgeous for the spring. And a red. You can't go wrong. But there, that's their nail varnishes. I'll see. It'll be a wear and compare day that will to see how long they last. Again, they need shaking because they've just been set around. I like that green. That green is gorgeous does need shaking it properly but that is absolutely stunning that I would wear and again that's the pink and I think they're both the same so one for my daughter one for me not that she likes pink but and in this one this is a trio pack of nail varnishes so I've got a lime green that's gorgeous and also, my eldest comes and just goes, I like that colour, Mama, can I have it? I like... Yeah, go on then, take it. Because that's the kind of mother I am. This reminds me of the metals from Barry M. And it's the 016. And it's one of them brassy colours. So... And then again, we've got a glitter bomb one. So, how many glitter bomb nail varnishes do people need? I don't know, but I don't mind. If you keep your nail varnishes in the dark, although mine are displayed up there, my blind is down 24-7. The only time it's not is when I'm filming. So, it, my blind is never up. That's why I have my nail varnishes out. And you have to keep them in the dark. Um, to, to keep the longevity of them, otherwise wouldn't have so many. So, and then these are the last three in this bag. Again, it's a trio bag, and we've got the NYC top coat in gold, and this is the O10 because I think I've just said that because that's what it said on the label. So. Uh, then we've got this gorgeous grey. Now I do, I'm into my greys at the minute. She says we're brown on the nails. Yeah, but I gel these, so um, when I don't gel, I, I've been wearing a lot of grey. So that is gorgeous. I was going to go, isn't that nice? <laughs> and then the next one is Showtime Nail Art. And do you know what? If I was artistic, it would really benefit me but I am not because this is just one of them fine artists brush and I just haven't I've got quite a lot of nail stuff that 
I paint my nails and then it's like I can't bother to put anything else so well, I can't bother to do that I should really be bothered but I just can't be bothered so this is my pound world or poundland haul so I think I got quite a lot for my money and I'm happy so hope you guys enjoyed this uh, if you did and again if you're new to my channel please hit subscribe and also if you enjoyed this video please give us thumbs up a big thumbs up should I say not give us a some thumbs up and also if you uh, want to leave a comment below then please do on anything that you would like me to try for you so I uh, hopefully I'll see you in the next one bye